What's up, people? So, I've been working on the, on the uh, camper, the Overlander, oh, about three hours, I guess. I got the floor completely finished. It looks great. I mean, it is solid. It is good to go. The insulation's on the bottom of it, or in the middle, sandwiched. But it, it just, it's coming out really nice. It may be off a half of a one eighth of an inch, but I'm good with that, believe me. But um, I started building on the frame. Um, I'm doing this part right here, this little front. This little box right here is a little extra thing. I'm gonna get, it's probably gonna be a toolbox. But um, I'm working on this part right now, up. So right there to down, that's what this right here is. That's exactly 30 inches from down here to the top of this. And then it's gonna go, and it's gonna go something like that. And then over. Yeah, talk about, and everything is, uh, I got everything on um, Gorilla Glue. So, except for the floor itself. I didn't want to do the, I didn't want to glue the floor just in case I got to rip that up maybe a couple years from now. I didn't want to fool with that, but so far the frame is all glued down everything. Every wood piece is glued. This this is hardly shaken. It's going to shake a little bit just because there's nothing to reinforce it. The bubbles turning out really good. The leveling um I got this one by three right here from right here over all the way down is going to be my sleeping space. And that equals out to 80 inches from this point over. And once I build the addition and then comes up, that's going to be my storage area. <clears throat> but man, I can't tell you how excited I am about this build. It's so much fun. And I'm doing it all by myself. I don't want no help. I want to, I've always, I've been wanting to do this. I don't know. I bought a military camper a bunch of years ago. And um, that was my plan. And then I ended up basically giving it away for like a hundred bucks. I think I got it for like 300. Basically gave it away. But yeah, I finally get to do this. I'm going to do it all by myself. I don't need no help whatsoever. Now, the only thing I will help need help on is welding. I'm not a welder, so but there's a guy that lives down the road that does um he restores old vehicles, so I'll, I'll probably hit him up and see if he can't weld if I need it. And like I said, uh you know, I don't need too much welding, I don't think. I don't know. We'll just play with it, I guess whenever I get done with it. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my progress today. I'm really excited. It's a lot of progress. That floor was, it was a motherfucker, but I got it going. All right, later, peace.